the Department of Public Works and Highways, Department of Transportation and San Miguel Corporation lead the inauguration of the newly constructed Metro Manila Skyway Stage 3, on Thursday, January 14, 2021. Philippine President Rodrigo Roa Duterte attended the event as guest of honor, also presents in the event, Senator Christopher Bongo, San Miguel Corporation President Ramon Esang, Executive Secretary Salvador Medial Dia, Department of Public Works and Highways Secretary Mark Villa, House of Representatives Speaker Lord Alan Velasco, Department of Transportation Secretary Arthur Tu Garde, Department of Budget and Management Secretary Wendell Avasado, Department of Finance Secretary Carlos Dominguez, Bases Conversion and Development Authority Secretary Vince Dizon, Presidential Spokesperson Harry Roque, and the newly appointed, Metropolitan Manila Development Authority Chairman Ben Hare Abalos Jr. President Duterte said in his speech and I quote, Today, through the hard work and cooperation of Department of Public Works and Highways, Citra Central Expressway Corporation, and San Miguel Holdings Corporation, we finally open this 19 km segment of Skyway which runs from Buendia in Makati City to North Luzon Expressway and here in Balantawak, unquote. Meanwhile, San Miguel Corporation President Ramon Ang, expressed his full support to the Build 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 program of the Duterte administration, saying and I quote, Mr. President, your vision of a better life for Filipinos truly inspired us to work harder for the brighter future. Mabuhay po kao at marami pong salamat. Unquote. Lastly, DPWH Secretary Villa expressed his appreciation to Mr. Ramon Ang for the completion of the project, and to the Toll Regulatory Board, through the Department of Transportation, Secretary Arthur Tugarde, for helping to facilitate the acquisition of the right of way. Secretary Villa said and I quote, On behalf of the government, I stand up my profound gratitude to San Miguel Corporation and its visionary leader, Mr. Ramon Ang, who is passionate to drive this project forward. Indeed, we can't thank you enough for sharing a vision of a better Philippines. And of course, I would like to thank the Toll Regulatory Board under the leadership of Secretary Arthur Tu Garde who really played a critical role in delivering the right of way of this project." Unquote. The Metro Manila Skyway Stage 3 project is part of the Build 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 program of the Duterte administration that is aimed to decongest the traffic in Metro Manila especially in Epifanio de los Santos Avenue also known as EDSA and other major roads in Metro Manila. The Metro Manila Skyway Stage 3 will connect the North Luzon Expressway and the South Luzon Expressway that shortened the travel time from the south going to the northern part of Luzon Island. The Metro Manila Skyway Stage 3 project is a 18.83 km elevated expressway from Buendia, in Makati City to the North Luzon Expressway in Balantawak, Kazon City. The original project cost is worth 37.43 billion Philippine pesos and was revised and increased to 44.86 billion Philippine peso, will said to be reducing travel time from 2 hours to just 15 to 20 minutes from Buendia in Makati City to Balantawak in Kazon City. The Department of Transportation said and I quote, starting today, the main line of Skyway Stage 3 will be open to the public. Motorists can seamlessly enjoy all access points and seven lanes on select areas for free until February 1, 2021, unquote. End of